Okay, chat. I have here for you now some questionable Mario World levels. Essentially, this is a contest. SMW Central held first SMW uh, Central questionable level design contest. And I guess the rules were just, you know, questionable, cursed, whatever. Uh, get experimental, get wacky, one level per person. And um, I have the top entries, the winning entries that I'm going to check out. I'm always up for shit like this. Oh, I remember that weird nose. I don't know why this Mario with the weird nose is familiar, but he is. I made this. Whip nay nay. Okay. Are you doing number one first or last? I'm not sure. It says number one. So this could be the, the winning entry, or I'm not sure if there was an order to it. Go into the contraption to your right and hold the A button to get infinite lives. Oh. It works! Oh god. Oh yeah. So, so okay. So it seems to be the NES... Okay, this is like the NES port of Super Mario World ported back into Super Nintendo. <laughs> so that's pretty fucking amazing and just a complete waste of one's life and time. So I, I would imagine, yeah, that counts as questionable. There are enemies raining from the sky. Um, corrupted bats, dick clams in the sky as well. Can't even get the fl Okay, I got the flower. R. Is this level based? Mario, there's water in the sky! I don't know if this is, like, the number one winner. Um... I think it's just in order of submission. Vinny, you have to press R. Oh. If anyone knows... Like, what the actual, like, if there was a first place winner of this contest. Let me know. Sure is Mario knows. I'm holding R, Chad. I'm holding R. I pressed it, and I held it, and I pressed it. There is a top three plus a bunch of specifics. How about this? Why don't we just go through the levels and not worry about which got which place, and just enjoy the pack? You can't hold R while you're, um... Oh, oh, I see! You can press it, and it switches the blocks. Chat was trying to tell me that, and I just didn't. Yeah, this is questionable is one way to put this. Oh, no! Oh. Well, this is actually, like, really cool.
Hmm. Do you have to be small, Mario, for this? I think you do. Oh. Oh, yo. It's rewind time. No, you can't jump because that is the end of the level. In Mario World, once you, like, hit the goal, you're done. You don't have control over Mario anymore. Which is why it's kind of surprising that you can press R in the first place and it does something. Is that a reference to popular Vine Sauce ROM hack, Mario's Mystery Meat? Why? I don't know if it is. I've never played Mario's Mystery- no, I, I have, but I don't know, um, specifically if it is, no. Oh, this- no. Oh. Well, it's kind of an automatic level. You still have to... The R button has been used in a lot of Kaizo ROM hacks. Oh, I didn't know that. You see, I'm not as... well-versed in the um, Mario World Kaizo community. Ay! Cursed levels? Sure. Kaizo? Not so much. I mean, this is kind of Kaizo, in some ways. Without Rewind, good fucking luck. More? There's still more? Oh, the blocks have dispersed. That's nice. I guess, sorry, nothing. You get nothing. It says Moonbase Dagama, but it's called Ham of Justice. Which sounds like Spork of Doom, Penguin of Doom, but I, I don't... Mario approaches the orbital base of his nemesis, Thwomp Boss. For some reason, he brought a wooden baseball bat. Is he going to help? Maybe? Field of Coopers, perhaps? Wait, why are the coins small? What, um... Ututur! Why is Ututur? That is an enemy from Zelda 2, but it's throwing baseballs. Okay. So Mario just has a bat. That's- that's what this is. I kind of like this version of Mario World better. Mario should always have a bat. What did that say? Uh, I don't know, some- some stuff. Sorry, I skipped it. Something about a science team? Um, okay, that was bad. That just <laughs> teleported me back. Questionable. Does the science team have any idea why wooden impact messes up the basilisk's hollow matrix so badly? Hmm. 
Uh, I'm assuming there are blocks that you have to activate. Of course, everything throws baseballs. <laughs> Why wouldn't it? I actually kind of really like the bat mechanic, though. Like, questionable aside. It's kind of fun. I want to at least keep that. Yeah, I, I will be using rewinds frequently, chat. Oh, well. Was that pipe attempting to kill me? Please. Oh my god. You are going to become a monster that can only play Mario's with Rewind. No, 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 no. I can do Mario World no problem. I mean, yeah, I'll die a couple times, but I can do it. I can do it. This? No. Yeah, this I'm going to need them Rewinds for. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Oh, God, it turned into a key. But yeah, I mean, it's just, it's obviously, obviously it's a lot easier for me to do the rewind as opposed to failing and then only checking out like a couple of the maps and dying constantly. Obviously. But you knew that, chat member. Chat member deluxe. Oh. Uh. Streamer, I bet ass at Mario game. <laughs> oh, fuck. No. I mean, this is basically Kaizo. I'm sure there's... No, no, it's not basically Kaizo. It's just difficult. It's, it's hard. On more than one checkpoint. My bat was stolen. We underestimated the whole bat thing. Let's just take it away. Lol. Thwomp boss. Don't like the look of this place. This is probably going to turn into another... Lose progress pipe. Bonsai bills. Or what? That's the name of the, what are the name of these enemies? These are like one of the least used enemies in Mario World. Torpedo Ted. Right, right, right. See, I'm. They're not even Bill. The name's not even Bill. Yep. Lost progress. Bill and Ted. Oh. Yeah, I never even thought about that. I wonder. Bullet Bill and, Bo and Torpedo Ted. Interesting. And it just makes a lot of sense. I guess it could be Torpedo Tom, but... I don't know. Torpedo Ted has a nice ring to it. Oh, 
Oh yeah, and Reznor. There's Reznor, one of my favorite enemies. Torpedo Trent. I don't know. I don't know what to do from here. It goes very fast. Oh, oh, very lucky. That was like almost no time at all that I had to uh, to do that. Are you supposed to be switching with R? I don't I don't know. Oh man. Yeah, don't worry, normal humans can do this. Really, we can. I feel like I know this music. Maybe not. This is for the Mario World Pro Gamers, not for me. Okay, now do it without rewind. Don't worry, chat, there's only like 50 more levels. First place is number 67, Asia. Second place is 10, Stivy. Third place is 35, Frozen Quills. I will keep that message. On hand, if needed. Thank you. Well, it was good. This one's called Friday Donut Segment 1 Zone 2. Huh? Just a little curb your enthusiasm. I kind of just want to hear the curb your enthusiasm music in Mario World. Like, continue, please. By all means. Mogus and and who? Oh, it's meme hell. It's meme hell. Fishy's journey. I like fishy man. He's he's not Mario. He's just fishy Mario. Why is everything cursed? I love it. And this is the stuff you cannot do in Mario Maker.
lag. Oh yeah, lag. It actually it actually does lag you. It, it's actually helpful. Like it helps you make better jumps. E. Oh. Uh. <laughs> I like his stupid face so much. Did you see Pepto Glismol? I don't know what you're talking about, chat member. You you just stop right there and we'll just move on gracefully. Hot dog boiled in Pepto. That better not be what that is. Rip Van Fish appeared. What will you do? Uh, Pokemon. You cannot access this menu because you are the Pokemon. What? You didn't know? Jump. You jumped. The enemy saw the height of your incredible jump and stared at you in awe. You fall back onto the ground. Pretty good timing. You surfed on the waves. You looked cool, but didn't achieve anything else. The enemy gives you cool glasses. You splashed around a bit. The enemy enjoyed that, so they splashed along. You both achieved nothing. You tried tackling the enemy, but you just phased through them. They look at you weirdly. You don't have any items. You don't even have a bag in the first place. Enemy used hug. The enemy hugs you, but the SMW engine kicks in. You take 20 damage. It's super effective. Fishy fainted. Every day we fall further from God's grace. The flesh will rot, my mother. But we must have. Repent, Douglas, for you have broken my thrill.
Oh yeah, my microphone looks torsion. Oh, Styla! Yeah, that was me. Chad thought that was the game. Chad, this doesn't make a whole lot of sense. No, I mean, like, I don't know how to complete this. Stop going in the reset door. Uh, yeah, just that's that's all I gotta do. Just stop going in there and, and Vinny, keep going forward. That that would be honestly great if I could do that. That would be really cool. Um, how pray tell do you expect me to do that? Try using coins as your guide. There's no floor down there, dog. Let the egg push you and keep moving to the right. A valiant effort. The reset door is probably to reset the egg. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, chat, I, I think I'm good on this one. Hold A as you fall. You need momentum. I'll try one more time then with the momentum. I'll do a rewind. Yeah, that's pixel perfect, pretty much. You you just have to get it right in there, chat. Like, right in there. And then you have to avoid this. Why, why do they all have to be, like, this level of difficulty? Can't they just be fun? Can't they just be, like, like cute little fish stories? Did you pop all the bubbles? If no, go and play the level again if you want to say with coins. It's optional. Okay. Hell no. Hell no! Lecredits. Lecredits. Well, I liked this one because of Fish Mario. I enjoyed Fish Mario. And there was a couple of fun platforming challenges. The end just went off the rails completely, but all right. I'm not the target. Listen, I understand I'm not the target audience 100% for this. People who play a lot of Mario World, maybe. Maybe people that are, like, very familiar with hacking Mario World. I mean, maybe I'm a little bit of the target, but I still sucked at it. So this one was the second place winner. 
and this one's called Stevie. S T I V I. Stevie. Okay. S Slithering Capitalism is the name of this one. Okay. Yeah, could get spicy, I don't know. Could you get spicy in a Mario ROM hack? No. Huh. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. Again, um, precision. Precision and knowing... Knowing how to do this... With- with some degree of accuracy, which I do not know how to do, really. But it's like... There we go, I, I kinda got it now. Alright. No, yeah, you control it. Oh, fuck this one. No way. No, 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 <laughs> no. This one's called Bumpty. Bumpty, please play this game. Mario! Check this! I found this cool program that lets me make levels. Come play my first epic level, bro! It's like old Luigi plus, um, Italian. Luigi's cool level. Yeah, that was Tetris Attack music, huh? Oh, Mamma Mia, that wasn't supposed to happen. Uh, what? Oh, Luigi's level broke. Haha, <laughs> gotcha, bro! Luigi, you motherfucker. Luigi designed those previous levels, too. This whole contest and all of its results were devised by Luigi. Prankster. Those, those dick clams are actually coins. Aha, gotcha, bro! Remember working on this part of my level? Mamma mia, what's happened here? Maybe I forgot to save my maps... My map 16s. It is ihackdestroy.exe, a virus destroyer of computers and files. This SMC file is mine. Die. Luigi's level got hacked.
Yeah, this is hack music, the sound of the virus hacking your compute computer. Okay. Moon Moon is Japes, confirmed. I guess that's gonna happen anyway, so. Invisible death? Don't need that. Hmm. Aha, gotcha, bro! I knew I shouldn't have opened that link Bowser sent me. It was a virus. Mario, you have to stop it, please. I will destroy this SMC file no matter what. Come and face my destructive virus powers. Why would Luigi open a file from Bowser? Also, why would Bowser do that to his friend Luigi? Truly delinquent behavior. They're not real. What are you talking about? Are you telling me? Wait, wait, wait. Who's not real? What are you talking about? Are you trying to say Luigi and Bowser aren't real? Or the chat's not real? Which which one, chat member? Praise be to the rewind feature. hasn't changed. Uh, it will. It's collapsing as we speak, sliding back into the entropy of perfection. Oh. Quickly, Mario, get out of there! Enjoy your perfect world. Wow, better graphics now? Why are the graphics so good? What? Cool life bonus. <laughs> That's it. All right. Uh, I liked, I liked that. Kerfuffle. Thanks, Luigi. Own a musket for home defense. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. The 
six bayonet and charge the last terrified rapscallion. He bleeds our out waiting on the police to arrive since the triangular bayonet. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Tally ho, lads. It's a copy pasta. Okay. <laughs> it's so fucking stupid. Oh, Jesus. Already. Yeah, it's just Mario World, but with a gun. Nintendo, for some reason, did not like Mario shooting straight ahead. That's like a forbidden thing for Mario. It has to, like, bounce off the ground, or you have to throw it in an arc above your head. It's too boring, says a chat member. I mean... It's, yeah, it's iconic. And then they, like, gave him a Super Ball power-up, which was another, like, really weird decision. In Mario Land. But yeah, almost like... Is there... Has there ever been a power-up where Mario just shoots ahead like a bullet? Boomerang? I guess that's the closest. But Boomerang is still... You know, comes back to you. Close, though, yeah. Oh, Mario and Rabbids. Rabbids. Please read the text box. No, I'm good. If y'all think guns are for targets, you're about as sharp as a mashed potato. Guns are for killing, corpses are for throwing. That's what you wanted me to say. Oh, Yo Yoshi Safari was one, and also the shooter levels of Mario. Um, of Mario Land as well, yeah. Alright. Third place is Frozen Quills. That was a hint. I've already given up chat. In order to see maximum levels, we should continue on. Beep. Beep beep. Beep beep beep. Beep 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 beep. 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 Ha. Mario go burr. Third place, by the way. Third place. So, yeah, it's Mario Run on steroids. Wonderful, <laughs> fucking wonderful. Oh, oh, oh. 
Oh, gotta climb fences now. Oh, there. Mm hmm. Well, I guess I can see the questionable game mechanic here, and it's actually kind of fun. It's the blue shell from New Super Mario Brothers. I guess it kind of is, isn't it? Still questionable. Interesting. Point of advice, look out for things. Things. Avoid things to win. Avoid things to win. I've already disregarded very, very important advice. Oh, I see. Haha, -ha, gotcha, bro! It took me that long to figure it out. I still haven't figured it out. Haha! <laughs> gotcha, bro! Um... Chat? Chat. What the fuck is going on here? It goes- it's too fast. It's too FAST! Block behind you at the top. I uh, face left and drop it. Oh, yes, you were right. That was amazing. What the hell is this game mechanic? DollarBallsClub.com, everybody. And you too can have... Th that's right, this is brought to us by our sponsor, DollarBallsAdayClub.com. You too could have ones that look just like that. Like the thing from Fantastic Four. All you gotta do is sign up, you get 13 balls a week, you use them, you put them in a prune stew, and just let them, just let them ferment. And you let them ferment 13 times a week. And you, you get yourself... 
some clus. All right, I, I think I've had enough of this one. I'm just going to look for some good names. Benchkun. Good title. What if Boo twerked instead of laugh when you stare at him for too long? <laughs> Mario buys a mouse. Sorry in advance if you're using a controller, you use a keyboard if you can. Ugh. Oh, fuck this. No way. Not what I expected. I, yeah, I need to hook up an SNES mouse to this game console. Please set up the mouse. It's worth it. I, I do not know how to do that. I'm trying. I've... I don't know, I, I have input, use SNES mouse. Um... Joypad number two. Uh, use SNES mouse. I think this is a meta joke. Okay, here's what you're gonna do. Press the Windows key, press G, and then you wait. And then you subscribe to our sponsor, dollarballsamonth.cock. I like this bit. It is a good bit. Really funny joke. I don't know, chat, I don't know how to enable the second port. Enable mouse in second port. That doesn't... It doesn't... There's no button that just says mouse second port. <laughs> like, it's not a thing that I can just do. I'll try one more time. I'll restart. I have the mouse. Okay. Well, now I can't escape the title screen because the mouse is not real. Alright, next entry. DP box. You plugged it into port one. Yep. Animation's so good. Why is the why is the animation so good? It doesn't need to be. Oh man, that's um really high quality stuff you got there, game. You can just fly, and you can shoot from your, your magical horn. And you stomp on flowers. It's the Discord statue. He's a villain who was sealed in stone. Uh-oh, getting dizzy, losing consciousness. Boy, a lot of these sure enjoy incorporating, like, faux corruptions. This would be the last one I would have expected fake corruptions from.
Discord is John Delancey, right? Okay, gotcha. I I, I knew he was in the show. I just thought Discord was some kind of meta joke about some Discord. Uh, I didn't know that was a actual character. I, I don't know why I am talking like this either. Maybe slightly, slightly weird to talk like this. I don't know. Discord is an actual word. Yeah. I would know most of my music sounds it. <laughs> nah, that's a funny joke, but it's not true. Someone said, be nice to yourself. Uh, you know, the, the, there's a fine line between being too nice to yourself and becoming uh, a raging narcissist. I don't think that would ever happen, but I think it's okay to poke a little bit of harmless fun at yourself. And I think the idea that it's like we have to stop him from making fun of himself, I think that's very silly. And I think it's okay. I think it's okay to be a little bit more... Uh, self-effacing. As long as it's not, like I said, a week ago or so. As long as it's not like every day, every minute, I think it's okay. But then again, I'm just one person playing a pony game. <laughs> what do I know? I, chat, I, I've actually had enough of this. I gave it a fair shot. I actually gave it a fair shot. N this one's called Nerd Dose, but also Anon's Paradise. Okay. Doses. Oh, those are the, that's the name of the author. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, the music has been good pretty much across the board. But a lot of it's music that we've heard in, in other games. Or, like, remixes. Nothing wrong with that. Vinny, why does this music sound moist? That was a direct response to that Bruh. chat member. Oh. Herb. Herb. <laughs> you get a double insult. Herb. Bruh. Herb. Bruh, Herb. See the questionable game mechanics here, chat. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> I get the picture. I'll check out the first place winner in a second. Super Mario, uh, Super I Hope I Don't Win World. Fast ground can make Mario insert himself in it, which is bad, and he dies for compensation. Retry exists. Wow, I feel like I had a stroke reading that. Chat. Like, that actually hurt my brain a little bit. Um. You can go ahead and screenshot that and read it to yourself. I'm, I'm gonna pass. Mario House. Oh, let's go in Mario House, everybody. Live, laugh, love. This is a nice place. Very cool that Gygus also lives here. Um, the uterine chamber is looking very clean these days. Alright, let's, let's just go this way. 
door. Is Wario wear music? Oh, Lost Vikings. That's a name I've not heard in a long time. Still one of my favorite rentals. Those fucking Lost Vikings games. Even though you can imagine how upset I was that I couldn't just use a sword the whole time. I had to switch characters and solve puzzles. But then I got acclimated to it, and I ended up really enjoying it. know the name of this one. It's just the idol, um, the name of the creator's idol. Okay. We really don't get the idea that was pretty short. Well, it was crushers. They were crushers. It crushed you into the ground. Maybe there were more mechanics. Um, sorry, I didn't show you more of it. But it looked like we were just getting a lot of crushers. All these years later, and I'm still struggling with these springs. These... Yeah. These look like bean. <laughs> okay, the game mechanic here is that you can... You just kind of, like, get stuck in the air on those things. I guess. It's kind of weird. Come on. How do we get up there? Jump under the ball? That is such a good noise backwards. Nope. However... Do you get the idea, chat members? I think you get the idea. Okay, cool. Green Jerry is the author of this next one. And, uh... Check out Blue Leaf's entry. The title screen is enough. Oh my god, some of these are... He Heeb? Player 1? What? H Hebe? This is my QLDC questionable level design contest entry. You'll lose coins upon getting hit. You'll need to use this new ability to beat this level. Hmm, what other game series has a mechanic where you lose the collectibles when you get hit? Snowick, perhaps. This purple block only works if you have no coins. Oh. Ow. 
somewhat questionable. Use the Yoshi coins to make bridges. The vine plants make clouds and blocks with coins disappear when hit. Yeah, backwards. Don't, you don't want to get too close to those lads because they just fling you. Dude. God. Oh my god. This is this one's fucking weird, but I get it. I get what's going on here. I like it, but um it just throws a lot of what you know about Mario World into a grinder and then you get grinded upon. So yeah, I don't know how I feel about it ultimately. That and um ah that and a lot of this stuff, almost every level I've played, I've needed rewind. I'm sure they're designed around that, but yeah. Rewind has been very important. This guy is bad gamer. I, I have never seen, never foreseen such a man. I have never foreskinned this man. Oh, all right. What was the one? It was blue something. Yeah, uh, Blue Leaf. You wanted to see the- the- okay. Good. Well, now with- uh, with this, I have to. Blue Leaf, more like blue balls. I hope I get disqualified. Well, they won something, because they're here. Okay, the winner is number 67. We will get to that as soon as I check this out. Chrono Trigger. Shotless theme. Which, if you want me to like your level, just do that. God. God. Oh my god and a half. God and a half shell. Turtle power. Yeah, the Phantos just, they keep coming. They don't stop coming. They just keep coming and they don't stop coming, but they can only go down. Phantos. This didn't win, no. I, I'm sorry, I explained it improperly. This one didn't, but the next one, I, sh I will show you, has won. If this isn't the end of the level, then I am happy I made it to the first door. Nope. Alright. 67 from Asia. A-J-A, -A, like the Steely Dan album. This is the winner. Questionable level design contest. Colorful confusion. Oh. 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 
Welcome. This is Colors Land. In this strange land, we find that consistent level design is missing again. Looks like Super Mario World Central is at it yet again. Every color will behave differently. Be sure to read the message boxes. I have to read? Skip, 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 skip. Green is air. Yellow is solid. Red is damage. Blue is water. Oh, right. <laughs> All right. This is so fucking weird because it it is messing with my my brain, man. It's all the things you know you know about Mario World, and then you don't know them anymore. So, just stand on the yellow stuff, jerk. Alright, can't do that. This is questionable, but I, I really like this. Yellow is damage, green is solid, red is water. <laughs> Fuck you! White is climbable. Oh, okay, okay, hang on. So, so green is solid, and red is water. Green is solid, red is water. Solid. Alright, oh, blue is air, okay. Um... Wasn't... wait, wasn't red? Huh? Ground is... is air still? Read the whole message again? The floor didn't get the memo. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I see now. Yeah, wow. Okay, wow. Yeah. Okay. It's fucking hell. God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This game. Shit. Oh, because the ground didn't get the memo. What, you didn't get the memo? I'm out. You're out, I'm in. The people want more Vin. Shit. Fuck. Ground. Air. Ground. Uh, climbable. Blue is be uh, bl blue, 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 blue. No. Blue floor is water still. Oh, right, because, yeah. Mm hmm. Had another moment. Bastard. My mind is rotting. Yes, it is. Yellow air, green vanilla. <laughs> what do you mean? Pink is water, cyan is climbable, white is damage, empty is solid. The ground was fired for not following the rules. Nah, I'm, I'm good. I can't, I can't do it. My brain, I, it's too late. It's too late in the night. It's too late in the evening. Take a screenshot of it. I, I guess I could, but... <laughs> um... Uh. Oh... Oh my god. 
munchers will act differently depending on how many of the same color are in a row. One is solid, two is damage, three is hair, four is water, five is climbable. It's just... I'm... That was... So that's the number one Mario World questionable level design winner. I... It, my brain hurts, everybody. My brain hurts. Let me just type that in. Doctor, my brain hurts. Are you the brain specialist? No! No, I am not the brain specialist. No! No, I am not! Yes! Yes, I am! My brain hurts! It was hilarious. You had to be there. Anyway, chat, thank you for watching tonight's stream. Uh, it, it, it was definitely rock'em, sock'em, mind-bending. You know, you want your balls to be like that guy from the F Fantastic Four. You know, if, if you got them, you soak them in prune, ferment, fermented prune juice, and, and you, you too can dollar ballclub.week.cock. Uh, uh, thank you for watching. Goodbye, everybody. Thank you. I, I'll, I'll see you during the week with more video games. Um, we'll resume Parasite Eve. We'll uh, do more... Uh, I don't know. What are we going to do? More stuff. Wario. Finish that up. Try to get to Pizza Tower. Um, I suppose I could watch Infinite Seinfeld again and get another 100,000 views in two days on a YouTube video for some reason. Absolutely insane how much that took off. And even just me watching it, just mental. I will raid Jerma because he's been very kind to me. He's been very generous. And um, don't shit up his chat room, please. I guess that's kind of... <laughs> I mean, really? Me saying that is going to work? Anyway... Jeremy is, is a good lad, and therefore I'd like for him to have some more viewers. So I'm going to do that for him. He's playing the Eternal Cylinder. I really didn't like that game that much, but I hope he likes it. Chat, last thing. Um, I guess I'll end by saying I'll be at PAX. I will be. Um, considering doing a signing as they want me to. Just saying, I'll, I'll keep you updated. Might be like a small little signing, nothing crazy. Um, also may have some pins. So, you know, it's, it's a little bit nerve wracking, but I think it will be, I think it will be fun. And I think it will be nice to, to do it again. So considering it, but we'll see. Oh yeah, no, I'll just, I'll get sick. It's fine. Listen, chat, if the person looks a little bit like me, but they're wearing a mask, but you're like, hey, I thought Vinny looked completely different than this person. It's probably me. It's not someone who's pretending to be me with a face mask so he can sign in my place while I eat clam chata. Good night. Fascinating. Oh no. No! Ah! 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 Ah!